I'm sure many of you must have heard this word. Don't try to be over smart with me. Today, I'm going to tell you about a story which will highlight this aspect. Hello everyone, my name is Sondarajan. I'm an educator, entertainer and a storyteller. Welcome to Kuti Story Season 2, Episode 3. Now, there was over smart or overconfident bunch of four students who thought they could do anything and get away with it. There was an exam which was planned the next day and they were partying very, very hard the previous night. And at 3, 3.30, they planned that we will tell a story or an idea to the dean and get away with this exam or postpone this exam because as if now they were not in mood to give that exam. Next day, as per the plan, they went with some dirt and shrugged uh, shirts with uh, you know uh, a, a sad face to the dean. And they gave an excuse that they went to the wedding, a friend's wedding, and on the way, the car broke and uh, they had to push the car uh, till the hostel. That's why they got late and they're not in a position to give this exam. The tire got busted and all that excuses was given. The dean listened to them carefully and informed them that, okay, the exam is postponed for three days for four of you. Come prepared and let's give the exam again. Best wishes. The students were happy that they were able to convince the dean and try to be so overconfident, but they were smart. They were uh, good studying students, so they studied well and they prepared for the exam and they went again again uh, to the dean after three days that so we are all set for the exam and we are prepared so the dean smiled and replied them okay all set all four of you will sit in different rooms and give the exam so that you don't discuss they said they were well prepared for the exam for the last three days so they were sat in a separate room and when they got the question paper there were only two questions. One, what is the name of the student which I had carried for one mark out of 100 marks? The second question was that which tire in the car was busted? And there were four options. Front, right and left, back, right and left. And they were supposed to tick the box. Well, this shows us that if you try to be overconfident, over smart with your planning and everything, there'll be somewhere you'll stuck and there'll be someone who'll caught you with your overconfidence. So the lesson from the story, the moral of the story is that you have to plan, you have to be smart enough, but don't try to fool yourself, fool others and try to be overconfident, whether it is with your colleagues or clients or anywhere in your professional life also. You need to get your, uh, uh, you know, planning in order. You need to be smart in this busy world, then only you'll be successful. But at the cost of uh, being smartness, don't over plan, overconfident. Be honest and be transparent with the other person. I'm sure the other person also will understand. If you try to fool around, if you try to, uh, you know, uh, be so overconfident, then it will for sure backfire. So this is the lesson you learn from this four student. Don't try to be that four students. Try to be someone who will be transparent enough to admit the mistake if it is ever done. And don't try to be over smart with anyone. If you like the story, please like, follow and subscribe the channel Sondra Speaks. You'll get more stories from me. Thank you so much once again. Have a wonderful, wonderful day.